Hey, what's up, you guys? It's me, Ruben, and I'm here with the star of Disney's original series, Corey in the House. I'm here with Kyle Massey. What's up, Kyle? Oh, what's going on? How you doing? I'm good. How you doing, man? I'm good, man. Good nice to see you. Good to see you. With the success of That's the Raven and Corey in the House, how has your life changed? My life has changed dramatically. Um, you know, coming from Atlanta, Georgia, you know, seeing all the celebrities and, you know, wanting, wanting to be like them and, you know, wanting to follow in the Denzels and the Will Smiths and the Martin Lawrence footsteps. Now yeah. it has actually become a reality wow. that I'm not, I'm not there yet, but I'm slowly, yeah. you know, picking up the pace to follow in their footsteps. You yeah. know, I got my own TV show now, so hopefully movies and things like that. But my life has changed, you know, now. People want my autograph, wow. you know, people, you know, want to see me, want to take pictures, and you know, that's different, but, you know, it's all part of the job, so wow. it's fun though. How is it like when you go to the mall and stuff, like, your hometown and just it, it's, it's like, now people are, are shocked to see me, yeah. you know, now it's like, whoa, look, <laughs> but before it's like, man, get out of here, man, no, we got no more of that, but yeah, it's like, people, people want to see you, yeah. you know, it's like, and, and that's a, that's, that's a great. weird feeling, because with me, I want I want to see people too. You yeah. know, I, I I love to see Will Smith, Marlon, <laughs> Denzel. Yeah. But it's like now I see how people feel, like seeing how I feel when I met them. Yeah. Now I see how people feel when they meet me, yeah. but, but on a different level. Raymond Simone, she's been acting ever since she was a little girl, and you worked on That's a Raven. Being around, you know, being on set and all that, did you learn a lot from her? Did she give you any advice to prep you for your own show? Well, what what I like that Raven did. Uh, which I'm gonna do when I, you know, like which I, which I'm doing now, yeah. and hopefully my castmates will do. What Raven did was, Bill Cosby taught her the do's and don'ts of the set, yeah. and Raven took those and she taught me, yeah. and I took what Raven taught me and I'm teaching my cast. Wow. And hopefully my cast will take what I taught what what I taught them, yeah. which came from you know the great Bill Cosby, yeah. and they'll keep passing it down. So each generation slowly gets better and better and better like that. Wow. But yeah, Raven's taught me a lot of stuff. You've done tons of um, voiceover work for like yeah. uh, American Dragon, Jake Long, and Teacher's Pet. Which do you prefer, being in front of the camera or being behind the mic? You know what? Um, I you know, that's a hard question because a lot of people will say they prefer the voiceover because you can just walk oh, exactly. in. You know, I can walk in like this. Yeah. You know, and just go in there and do my job, and it's all in my voice. Yeah. But at the same time, when you do television, you know, you got 250 people sitting out there cheering you on, rooting for you, wanting you to be good. And you know, that, that energy is priceless. You can't recreate that. Yeah. So I have to say I'm stuck in the middle because I, I really do like both of them. It's 50-50. Yeah, it's, I, I have to say 50-50. You're rapping on the theme song. You're <laughs> yeah, son. He beat <laughs> of your show. I've been stormed, <laughs> son. Um, yeah, so you're rapping on the theme song of your show. Would you actually um, consider pursuing a career as a rapper? Mm, no, I don't, I don't, I don't, maybe. Sky's the limit. Sky's, <laughs> sky's the limit. No, uh, I, I have, to, I really have to say I don't know. I'm uh, really on the fence because like, there's, there's so much that goes into that. People think that when you become a rapper, you have to be tough and you oh, know, yeah. hat to the back. And I'm, I'm not that. I'm goofy. Yeah. You know, like so, like. Like, like if, if I was a rapper, I'd have to be like Will Smith. Oh, yeah. Like, Will Smith, Will Smith was the first rapper to ever win a Grammy. Wow. And he rapped about parents just don't understand in school and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, it's fun where, stuff. Yeah, where, you know, like, if, like, so I really have to say, I, I don't know, I'm on the fence. Oh. <laughs> yeah, because it, 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 it all depends on how I approach it. Yeah. If I approach it like the Will Smith, then yeah, why not? Yeah. But if I have to approach it like you know, like one of those tough, you know, yeah, I got tattoos all over my face. <laughs> my face is a tattoo. Then no, nah, I don't want. I don't yeah. want to do that. That's not really me. Thanks, Kyle, for your time. Stick Thank around you, because I'm gonna be interviewing you and your brother.